Hi, Tammy Neal. We're, we're on there. Here, I'll let, you, I'll let you hold the microphone. Okay. And uh, I guess, first, those of you that, that join, can you hear us okay? This is, like, super loud in here. So, probably so can you guys can you guys hear us here in the Bloggers Cafe at ISTE? All right. Okay, so I'm Tammy Neal. You might know me on Twitter as Math Neal. I co-moderate the Florida Ed Chat, the Rural Ed Chat, and the new... Uh, new teachers to Voxer chat on Saturday mornings, and um, so excited to be here. Do we have any questions from the Periscope land tonight? Uh, I, what, what what attracts you to chats? Because you're involved in so many. What do you like about Twitter chats? Uh, well, one of the things I really like about Twitter chats is it allows me to connect with people who have something in common. So the topic of the Twitter chat is a common playground for those of us interested in learning more about whatever that topic is. So it's an automatic filter to resources and people who are amazing. So, well, A question, what's your big takeaway from ISTE so far? Um, so far my big takeaway is that everybody I've met so far has been totally real and uh, are as caring and as giving as they are on Twitter. So for me, the connection has been the most important thing so far. Most of the sessions I'll attend are tomorrow. So I, tomorrow's my big learning day. So today has been my big connection day. So Have you learned anything today? Um, I have learned lots today. I have learned about some new uh, programs and software and apps and uh, you know, new devices that haven't been used in my school before and that I'm really excited about bringing back. And I found some really great deals on some things that I've been looking for, like the uh, iPad case that Felix Giacomino supports. Uh -huh. It's on sale in the vendor hall. Can you, can you buy things in the vendor hall? I didn't yes. Know they, they yeah, some of the vendors uh, have things for sale. So you have to touch base with the vendor. If they've got their product on display, odds are you can buy one. Yeah. I'm going to switch, though. So. So you can see we got 40 people watching. And Yay! They'll usually send hearts. So there they are. Um, oh, George Kuros. Yeah. He's and, a yep. Oh, there he yes. Look at, look at all those hearts. Oh. Uh, so guys, yeah. Tony is amazing, and you should totally check out his Learning in Hand website. He no, he did not tell me to say that. <laughs> I've just known Tony for a long time, and he is one of the first, truly one of the first educators I ever connected to. Oh. Uh, um. E. The name of it was the iOS Graphite, I believe it was. Case. Yeah. It's got the double handles and all of that good stuff. So, yeah. Uh -huh. Yes, Tony is amazing. I agree with that completely. <laughs> well, thanks, Tammy. All right. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, over here, just coming to the cafe, is my good friend, Wendy Wells. Say hi. 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 How are you? So, uh, we, I saw you last night, we talked, and then we haven't spoken at all today. So this is a good time for me to ask you, what, what, did, what did you do, what did you see here at ISTE? Well, I spent a lot of time, to back up just a little bit, to not do a close-up, and a little bit closer. So today I learned a lot about new software that's available for educators, and um, also talked to a couple of developers and how they... Um, connected with educators on helping them to develop their software. So that was pretty interesting. Yeah, so now I'm in the Bloggers Cafe. Um, yeah, we can, we can take a look here. Yeah. Seeing educators connect all over. Try, trying to get people's attention. I don't know if that's going to if that's going to work or not. Um, you know, I, I went to a, uh, to a talks about it so much, and I really haven't sat down. I tried opening the app once. I bought it and, and, and then um, never really understood it. So I'd sat and just, just left that session where they, she just took us through some of the basics. And so now I have a new app to play on planes because uh, I'm, I'm, I really love Plants vs. Zombies, but I, I, could, I could try something new. So now I'll be Minecrafting when I'm on the, on the plane. So who, whose session did you sit in on Minecraft? Um, oh, I can't remember. She was a really good teacher, but I, I forgot her name. I'd have to, I have to go back and look. I'd have to go back and look. Set in some Minecraft sessions uh, two years ago, so I think there's a lot of new features with it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not a Minecrafter. I don't know. I, yeah, I built this 
whole thing to hold, and I put a bunch of chickens in there, and then I put lava in there, and then blew it up with TNT, uh, just just playing funny. around, yeah. <laughs> so that's fun. Yeah. Do you see anybody we should talk to around here? I got to talk to Angela Myers earlier, and I should have I should have asked her to periscope it because she's just a ball of energy and good vibes, and she was telling me about projects she's involved in. To work today. No? Oh, yeah, the connection. I've had to use my Verizon connection. The, the ISTE Wi Fi has been, been uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I did the Remind app. Have you, have you ever used the Remind oh, yeah, app? Yeah, Remind. Okay, so those guys were up here earlier and they were doing demonstrations of their app and they've added some new features. So some of the new features were. Um, that you could actually use it for polling software. So when you're connecting with your object, uh, audience, not just in your classroom, but as a presenter, you could use mm -hmm. it to have um, your audience give feedback, give instant feedback. Uh -huh. So it's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. So Remind used to be called Remind 101. Yeah. He said they dropped the 101. They dropped the 101. They felt like it had more iterations than just the first feature. Yeah. Because yeah. they've been adding a lot of things. So I researched it because I thought, Gosh, they, it must be big bucks to pay for that. So what what I found is I think it was uh, this. Is, don't quote me on this number, but it's like thirty seven thousand dollars they paid to get Remind dot com, oh, which seems cheap that. to me. I was expecting like like you yeah. know way more than that to to buy a domain like Remind. Yeah, and a lot. And their their main web page now says that they have like twenty like one in five teachers use Remind. Um, so that that seemed high to me, but maybe it's true. Yeah, they said they had, um, because I'm from South Carolina, and they said that they had a lot of accounts there in South Carolina, which surprises me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Could, could you guys tell she was from South Carolina? <laughs> <laughs> I, I joke. <laughs> yeah. so, so, so say my name. Tony Vincent. All right. Usually the, the Tony turns out to be like five syllables, but <laughs> remind, a lot of people are liking remind, and then... And, um, Oh, there's somebody from North Carolina in there. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, are you, you're periscoping this now? Yeah. Oh, wow. You didn't realize, no, oh. I didn't realize that. <laughs> 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 no, I didn't realize that. Thank you, everybody. I'm saying anything bad. No, no, no. People love Remind. They're gonna, there's people who are going to check it out. Look, they're even, look, they're giving hearts. Um, maybe Arisha is on from South Carolina. She was here in the Bloggers oh. Cafe, and I was given, telling her about the ropes, trying to connect with people from, here. Yeah. People from Iowa, California. We got 43 people in that all at once. That might be the, one of the highest I've had. If I say y'all, um, can you guess which state that's from? Usually I get Texas or Georgia, but South Carolina. South, South Carolina. South Carolina. Oh, and there's Kansas, Missouri, Indiana. is from all over. Okay. Wow. Oh, I've got a lot of hearts. And it's, and it's all people who aren't at ISTE because... This is a way for them to tune in, so it's been well, it's pretty neat. To connect. Well, let's see if we um, any, see anyone interesting besides yeah, Tony. Yeah, if, Wells. yeah they're, we're, we're interesting, but um, they're, they're talking about education chats on Twitter, um, and I think that that's, yeah, that's kind of the theme of the Bloggers Cafe right now. Yeah. So, how do people react when you walk around with Periscope? Usually, the you know, ISTE, the crowd isn't too bad, but... Um, then sometimes people just don't, it's the microphone that really gets them. If I put the microphone up to them or ask them to hold it, then they get a, a little nervous. Um, I, didn't, I thought you were just videotaping. I didn't realize I'm all, I was live. But now that I'm live, we can think of some really cool things to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought you would edit. And, but this no, there's no, there's no time to edit. And th this, this saves to my YouTube. Um, or I've been putting it on a site yet, but I thought, oh, I'll go through and edit. There's way too much video. I'm not editing. But at least on YouTube, you can fast forward and rewind. On Periscope, you can't. Um, you know, obviously, the live you can't. But even when you replay it, which expires after 24 hours, so yeah, there's there's some funny rules to uh, to, to Periscope. But but I'm learning. I'm learning. That's real. Well, I will learn tomorrow because I'm I'm going to connect and connect my Periscope to Twitter because right now it's not connected with the Wi-Fi here. And, and it drives me nuts. I want to do horizontal video so badly, but then the chat would be sideways in the app. Oh, okay. Okay, so I see the chat over here. That's really great. This is a great and, app. The, and yeah, it is. I wish I could scroll back in time to the chat because I miss a lot of, of what's there. Yeah. People say, no editing. Broadcast is real. Yeah. <laughs> so as somebody who edits uh, video and spends hours and hours, this is so refreshing to know I can do this and not have to worry about editing it. it it's, you know. Because you don't have to. Yeah. 
so cool. That is so cool. Um, Thanks. Yeah. The, so, so the, the star of it is my microphone. Everybody, want, I should hold it like this so you can see what what kind it is. It's an iRig uh, Mic HD, <laughs> and uh, I don't think I could do this without the microphone because it would be so loud in here. Um, so, and if you if you want to, yeah, it's like it's ninety eight dollars on Amazon. Tony V dot me slash microphone. I made a short link because I get get asked a lot. Um, <laughs> TonyV.me slash microphone will take you to the Amazon page for it. Yeah, yeah. We'll have, we'll have microphones in here tomorrow. We can. I'll bring our microphones and do Periscope in here tomorrow. Oh, so when? So and you tell us what your your name is on Twitter. Uh, Wendy Wells Ed Tech. How do you spell Tech? T E K. Ed Tech, T E K. Connect with me. Uh-huh. And I can teach you a lot with Southern dialect and how to connect with other educators. Yeah. Okay, well, if I still want to, I, I thought I would see pe- more people I know. I'm not as comfortable going up to strangers to ask them to, uh, to be on here. Um, yeah, they say no background noise. That, that's amazing because it is super loud in here. Like, I can. That's what, the, that's what they just said, yeah. It's, it's, I guess the mic is, is really good. Um, I should have a sign. I should. Like, I'm periscoping and come, come talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, let's, let's go over. Okay. Do you know, I have worn down my battery three times today and recharged <laughs> from all the, the, the periscoping I've been doing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Although it looks like there are people that are vendors over there. So there, I just spoke to Angela Myers, and she looks like she's really busy, but she would be such a fun person to talk to uh, in the dress sitting on the, on the table. She, yeah, so... Um, you've never met her, huh? Met oh, that's a good excuse to go talk to her. I could say, I want you to meet Wendy. Oh, and there's a camera in your face, too. <laughs> and I say, don't worry about talking to strangers. Everyone will be enthusiastic. 90% of the people I've talked to have been enthusiastic. So can I, can I bother you again? Well, two things. One, I'm, I'm periscoping right now, if you don't mind. You look, you look ravishing. But more importantly... It's, okay, the Angela Myers shoes. Yeah, you don't you don't get this online. Like you know, you got to come to ISTE to get her to get her shoes. So wow, and then your toes peek peek out there. Um, <laughs> shoes sh- shoe matter <laughs> hashtag <laughs> shoes matter. <laughs> but more more importantly, I want you to meet my friend Wendy Wells. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Wendy Wells. So where where are you from, Wendy Wells? Why don't you guess? Iowa? No. Oh. Colorado. Guess again. Maybe I should talk a little bit more. Talk a little bit more. Um, Australia? Oh, gosh. That was wonderful. Australia? No, I wish no. I was. No, but no. South Carolina. Oh, South Carolina. <laughs> I didn't say y'all. I love, I see, yeah. No, I love South Carolina. Okay. I love South Carolina. I just did an uh, event in Myrtle Beach. Is that South Carolina? That is. That is. That is. Beautiful okay. people. Yeah. Beautiful yeah. people. It's a great town. Yeah. 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 It's like it's Iowa with a southern yeah. accent. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that's right. I love that. She thought I was from Australia. Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay. okay. Here, okay. we'll sit. There, you go. Yes. there we go. We'll share the mic. We'll share the mic. New friends. Yes. So Angela, Strangers are friends me, not yet. So uh, say that again. Is not familiar with your work. I know. Well, Seriously. Sorry. <laughs> so how would you describe oh my gosh. all you you're involved with in, the, in your projects? And you'll need to visit AngelaMyers.com. Two so. words. Liberating genius. Hello. <laughs> Just that. I absolutely believe that we're in the presence of genius every day, every single day. I'm not talking about kids. I'm talking about I got to meet. It's a get to. I get to meet you. I get to meet Tony. Mm -hmm. Every single person here has something to teach us. Every single person, if we pay attention, has a gift to give. And most of the time, unless you're a five-year-old, you don't pay attention. And so five-year-olds remind us to pay attention to water. What is it? To water towers. Like. (laughs) Who cares about a water tower? And yet, but through the eyes of a five-year-old, it's amazing. And so when we start living life awake in wonder and in awe, so I sort of operationalized a framework so that we can remember what it was like when we were five. 
and most importantly, what it was like when we owned our genius, when we were fiercely confident, when we were grateful to literally just be awake. And I so we I call it liberating it. genius. And so when people do that, it's the deepest form of what I call mattering and they're choosing to matter. So most of people think when you choose to matter or do something that matters, you've got to like, you know, build a waterfall or, you know, go, you know, to a different country and solve world hunger. But most right. of the time it's just giving somebody a smile or being, being present, <laughs> being, being present in somebody's in life, yeah. being present. Yeah. We're not present with each other. And, and technology yeah. is a beautiful thing because now we get to connect with other genius learners we wouldn't, but Oh my gosh, mwah, mwah, mwah. 40 <laughs> like that is a miracle. This is what technology should be for, so but it's to be more connect? present. I have no idea. Okay. I don't know how we connect? connected. Um, uh, so wow. You, so you've written a framework about mm -hmm. around this. Yep. So, um, one of the things I used to it's teach called was gifted, you and matter. gifted children. Yes. And we talked about what is gifted and what is genius. That's right. And it's talking about conne that connection. It's connecting both of them. Yeah. Oh, oh. My name is Angela. Here. I like this is this is too much technology. I'm bad. How are you? How are you? This is like bad. So I'm what's really funny is like I'm keynoting all these tech conferences. Right. I'm not that tech savvy. People think like what's this I'm like I can't I mean, it's, even it's program it doesn't. But, but I am people it's savvy. The it's the that's right. Part of it, and it that's is what we need to focus on. It's the so social part awesome. of it. It is. Yeah. So I. Well, I feel I feel privileged. Oh to, my gosh! So do I. Presence. Oh, and this I man. I want to photobomb this. <laughs> this man. Oh no! Say <laughs> something. Tony, how you doing? This man we're, we're matters. Right yeah. Oh, okay. So, your Twitter's right on your shirt. Yeah. It's on my Oh my gosh, Tony! Come on. Yeah. If you do not, friends, new friends, if you do not know this genius man. You follow him right now because he is a gift to our community. He's a gift to our world. And he is one of my heroes, one of my learning heroes. Well, she's my so, hero. Yes. Because she matters so much to all of us. <laughs> and this is our new friend, Wendy. Wendy. And Hi. she's yeah, from nice South Carolina. You. Yes. Aww, you know Kitty that. Trip? We're so, are you, you have to make sure you follow me on Twitter and say hi at Angela Myers so that I can follow you back because I don't auto follow. I really care. People are like, how can you follow so many people? Well, how can you be in a room with so many people? It doesn't mean you interact with them all at the same time, but when you bump into them, there is an interaction that is going to be magical. So. Well, I am inspired. Man, I'm a jealous. I was, we're all in there together. Yes, right? we got to take a <laughs> selfie. Yes. <laughs> yeah. uh, we're not really right taking a, a selfie. A, a like, periscope like, selfie. Now, now you, you can see the, the hearts they give. They've been saying some really nice things. Oh, that's oh, awesome. Did you pay so them? Sweet. No, no. They're, they're people who, <laughs> okay, are, man, who can't come can to ISTE and they're just really there happy. Oh, 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 here we go. <laughs> you are here with us. So this is the beauty and the miracle of technology. This is Amazing. I am yeah, so happy. You. Nice to I meet you. I'm so I happy. Thank you, Tony, for introducing me. Ah, yeah. I just, and they just follow the hashtag, you matter. You matter. Yay, 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 yay. yay. And then what we're, yep. And so okay. we are so excited because Microsoft just joined okay. Choose to Matter, and they're helping us connect your kids so that your kids know how much they matter to the world. So just choose to matter.org. All right? All right. Thank uh, you thank so you. much. Oh my God. I, I've hugged so many people on Periscope that the, the camera just just shakes, but it, but it's good. <laughs> no, please. Can we talk to you? All right. Yeah. So um, you're you're really probably most famous for having like a, 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 I'm going to do that when I introduce you there for ha for having a catalog of a page for just about everything on the internet. And I remember <laughs> I told you I have twins. I got to add you to my people with twins page. <laughs> Um, so, what are what are you getting out of Visti so far? Uh, just meeting my PLN. Uh, you know, anytime you're with them, you're talking, you're learning constantly. You're learning, connecting, and sharing. It's awesome. Yeah. And then, um, what do you what are you looking for besides that? Or anything else out of Visti? Or are you just here for the to meet? Are you going to go to sessions? Or yeah, to learn. I'm a constant learner. We all should be constant learners. We should model this for our students. That's what we want them to be: constant learners. And not afraid to try things and fail forward. Don't you know if you make a mistake, there's nothing wrong with it. And when I want, I want to see more use of the tech expertise of our students. Tech expertise. Expertise. I thought I invented that, but I didn't. Oh well, I, 
Yeah, I, that's my first time here. I love that. Is that a, a hashtag too? Techpertise? No, I should make it one. You got a lot of hearts for that. I do, for I, mean, <laughs> I do have a student tech help page, which I think is very important. Every school should have a two, student tech help squad and a help desk. And my favorite expression is technology gives even the quiet student a global voice. Yes. Were you a quiet student? Yes. I was too. I was. That's why blogging is so great. Get the word out now, you know, and you can connect with the world. I've been telling people doing this, this pair really for me because I wouldn't normally, I mean, I would, I would, people I know like you, I'd come up and say hi, but I probably wouldn't ask the same questions. And so just by the fact that I'm talking to 55 people right now um, has really improved my conference experience because I'm asking things I may not have already. So people are saying it's so great to see you in person, in quotes, <laughs> yeah, all the hearts they're giving you. Thank you. <laughs> I love you all. You're the superheroes. Yeah. Me. Well, you are too. And you've got the cape to prove it. <laughs> okay, thanks. thanks, Jerry. Thanks, oh, and now we got to talk to Jed. Are you watching it? Yeah, the watching it. Scope yes. right now with the... Whoa. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> That's where all the bandwidth at ISTE is going. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Uh huh. He follows you. He follows you on Periscope, and he said, "Hey, Tony's up in the Bloggers Cafe." He said, "Go up there and see if you see him." So I walked up here. Okay. In case people don't know who you are, can I look at your name tag on here so we can? It's kind of my tradition now, so they can see your your website and that. Awesome. So what did you do today? Um, well, I I met a lot of awesome people, but I worked in the Skype booth to teach teachers that came up to the booth how they could connect globally with Skype and do some great inquiry-based learning with their Skype in the classroom. If they're afraid of the inquiry-based learning at first, we told them how they could just get in there at the ground level with just a basic mystery Skype. Yeah. People saying hi. I think Ryan Reed just said hi. Matt Johnson 10 said howdy, y'all. <laughs> hey, Matt. <laughs> we, we were just talking uh, for a while with, uh, with my friend Wendy over, over there who's, who's now best friends with Angela Myers. Yes, it's, Wendy's a South Carolina girl. Well, I'd love to see uh, South Carolina people up here representing on your show. That's awesome. So, well, what what um, was was the big thing you were showing in the Skype booth? What what really got people excited? You know what? The biggest thing that got them was just the fact that we could build empathy for people around the world and and grow our sense of a community around the world. You know, when you connect with a class that's in Africa, or Venezuela, Greece, Armenia, um, you realize that yes, you're different, but the differences um, are far less than our similarities. And it's just ab about building that global community through Skype and making these connections in our learning and realizing that the world really is a small place and we have a lot in common and we can build on that together to change the world to be even better. Yeah. So a, a little, I, I was kind of a nerd as a kid, <laughs> you mind, or geeky, geeky is, is a better word. But so I, I, I uh, saved up a bunch of money and bought a modem and paid for my own teen line and uh, it, there's local BBSs you would call into, yeah. and sorry, I clearly remember the, the day that the first time I'd ever done that. And there was there was, his his uh, username was like Cooley, I think, yeah. and it said he entered the chat room, he stayed there for a second, and it said he left, he didn't even say a word, and I got chills down my spine, like there was somebody in the same chat room. And he was just like locally, like across the city, right. you know. And then, but now as it's gone through, you know, and then we have so many friends like here on Periscope from from all over the world. Um, that, that I'm talking to right now, and it's still now, and I got chills down my spine yeah, again. Cool. Cause of, well, what was cool is I was in another building, and I was walking this way to come to the Bloggers Cafe anyway, and somebody texted me and said, hey, you should go check out Tony. He's doing a live Periscope. Go go see what's going on. So I walked up here. Yeah, I walked up here, and there you guys were. And so I started watching, and now here I am. I'm on here. So it's, it's so cool. <laughs> South Car so from South Carolina also, and so he's from South Carolina. So yeah, everybody's from South Carolina. Well, Aaron, Aaron Klein, how are you? Oh, I didn't know that you were. Are you periscoping? Are, are you okay with that? Um, yes, totally fine. No, you're. I know you're a little shy. Very shy. Completely introverted. No, I came over to take like our little pictures that we always do together. So yeah. You got a ketchup bottle around? Uh, I don't, but I should. Maybe a ketchup packet we can find. Oh yeah. So Erin Aaron takes very like she's she's the nicest person, but um, but when she has a, your normal face, you just look sometimes yeah. 
Like her normal face looks looks a little scowly. So <laughs> I swear I'm in a good mood. <laughs> but she is. She's she's super pleasant. But, uh, so we, we we take pictures together like that. You've been periscoping all day. And I love it because I keep getting notifications on my phone. So I get to be in two places at once because of you. So thank you. Okay, so I thought you were going to complain because Kathy Schrock is, uh, she says, Tony, every time you periscope my, she has an Apple Watch, she gets a notification on her wrist. Turn the notifications off. I think it's in settings. So, so what, what did you do today? Um, uh, lots. So I got to just mainly build relationships and connect and meet with people. That's my favorite thing. So got, I went to the Future Ready session earlier, got to meet with Brett and talk to him from Remind. And now we're going to go head over to the party. And, um, yeah, got, I went to the terminal. It was for food. Um, quite the experience. A little crowded. Yeah, but it was good. So I walked around the city, saw some sights. Pretty. Yeah, I almost didn't get lunch today because I was going from session to session and busy periscoping, I guess. And then when I went to go get lunch across the street, it was like the lines were out the door. So I had a sandwich from down the hall, and I wouldn't recommend it. Not good. Not when there's so much good food around here, and then I ended up eating that. It's terrible. Yeah, you have to make an effort to, like, eat. Otherwise, you'll forget to eat. So in case people don't know you, I've been showing name tags. So they sometimes people take screenshots so they can find you online. And I don't know, how does ISTE decide to put your Twitter on there or not? Cause some of them they have. I'm not on Twitter. Oh. Just, All right. You are definitely on Twitter. My name on Twitter is just my name. Yeah. All right. So that's how you can find Anything else we got? You, here, I got all those hearts for you. Aw, they're so nice. Here, we, we could do it. Let's do our, nah, let's just do our serious face. See, I always look mad. But wait, I got to do the selfie. <laughs> okay, so this is, this is our traditional selfie that we take whenever we're together. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now, I look pretty good in your glasses too. Then it would, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you know Aaron? I would, I, well, I've met you before, and we connected online. And I don't know if you remember me or not. I'm Wendy Wells. I met you with Blade, and yeah, at the Bloggers Cafe two years ago. Yeah. Yes, it was San Antonio. So I follow. I've been following some of your things that you're doing. Pretty impressed. Yeah, good stuff online. Yeah, good to see you. Yeah. Yeah, and that you get connected on Periscope. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, which one? Um, yeah, maybe. Is there food there? Because I had a terrible lunch. <laughs> ah. Ah. Maybe. Yeah. Well, there, there's lots of hearts here. I think I might wind down uh, this broadcast, but, man, what awesome people we had here. Um, yeah, yeah. So. That, that it was to Nick. He was like making faces. He thought what? <laughs> so I just stuck my tongue out. I was like, they probably thought that that was, was it him. Oh, no. The Periscope people there, they are nice. I don't think that. So, okay. Well, then tomorrow, I think uh, my next per Periscope, if I don't do one tonight about some of the things I did from uh, that I learned today. Uh, I'll probably be tired, too tired to do that. But there's more poster sessions uh, tomorrow morning that I'll uh, get to. So see you later.